the Xbox Series S. We got some dope news for this video. I put the grill in. Let's go. That's right. What's up? All right. started with the video you already know give it a like man i'm telling you it's about to be some heat boy. some fire thumbs up right now all right for the first time we have a leak from a credible source naming the second xbox console now it's been long rumored that microsoft is launching Launching, we already know they're coming out with the families of series. Just in the title, series, we know that there's going to be a series of consoles this generation coming from Microsoft. But now we get a confirmed name and the reveal date. This is coming from trustedreviews.com, but their source, according to a new report from Windows Central, Windows Central. They've been spot on when it comes to Microsoft Xbox leaks. The Xbox Lockhart will be shown off alongside the Xbox Series X in May and will be titled, they said may be titled the Xbox Series S. Now, for those of you that are not in the know, Last gen, Microsoft came out with the Xbox One S and they came out with the Xbox One X. The X was the most powerful of the two, but the S came in a little less powerful. Not a little, it was, it was less powerful because just the X was just a beast, that's why. The S was less powerful but came in at an affordable price point. And I tell everybody, if you picked up an Xbox One S, you picked up the best value in gaming. It was a great console and the value you get, Game Pass, all that stuff, good stuff. And so, it looks like in May, May we're going to get the reveal of the Xbox Series S. All right. So, um, this is what the article's saying. We've already seen the Xbox Series X spec sheet and it's very impressive. So it's not a huge surprise that here that Microsoft is going to be offering a cheaper entry level version of the console. It, it's more, it'll have a more appealing price point and may lure some customers away from the PlayStation 5 and the Xbox uh, One X. The Series S or Lockhart is rumored to be a four teraflop entry level console that's been talked about before for next generation effectively taking the place of the xbox one s this generation now i know what some dudes are saying only four teraflops my x right now is six teraflops but it's gonna have more a more modern architecture the solid state drive and the architecture will be more in line with the xbox series x and so even though it's only going to be four teraflop because of the architecture inside the system i'm hearing that it's going to be more for value than it's going to be more modern that's what i'm hearing more modern than the xbox one x all right now they're also saying that there's going to be a launch event in may there's going to be an xbox event in may and we could get some looks of games Microsoft is cooking up. I've already did a video talking about, I hope they reveal Fable. There's a couple games. If you've been following me at, on Twitter, at Obi-Wan Plays, if you want to get in the giveaway, you got to subscribe and follow me on Twitter anyway. I've been talking about, bro, bro, there's some games that Rare has in this back catalog they need to bring back, bro. They need to bring back 
first Banjo Kazooie. I said it on Twitter. Dudes were hot, but it was facts. Banjo 64 was better than Mario 64. And I've been saying that even back years ago. I've always said this. That Mario 64 was iconic. Great game. Don't get it twisted. Mario 64 was great. <laughs> this <laughs> conquers for a bad fur day. I'll tell you, this game. <laughs> but, this is reloaded and remastered on the Xbox. The OG Xbox. I'm going to probably play through this game. I I'm coming. I'm getting to it. There's a reason why I put this up there. But, Rare copied Mario 64, a great game, and just improved on it in every way. The graphics, you just look at both games side by side, the graphics are better. The gameplay, you look at the movesets of Mario Head, yeah, the triple jump was lit. <laughs> Banjo could do a whole lot more. Um, Banjo had a whole lot more movesets. The boss battles were more creative. The final boss battle, just think about this. The final boss battle with Grutilda the Witch. First, you had to do like a whole board game, um, checkerboard game. Then you had to answer questions. And then when you go up to the top and fight her in all those phases, it was crazy. Battle 64, grab Bowser by the tail, spin him around three times into the spikes. All the boss battles with Bowser were the same. <laughs> grab him by the tail, spin him around, throw him. It was... It, dudes are just blinded by it's Mario, but um, Banjo's the better game. Gameplay, graphics, everything. But another game I want them to remake is this Conquer uh, Bad Fur Day. This is the remake of the Xbox, but they need to remake it in 4K, great graphics. I'm probably going to play through this game. I'm going to beat ReCore, Quantum Break, and I'm probably going to play this Conquer's Bad Fur Day Reloaded, Conquer live and reloaded after I beat Quantum Break. So, um, can't wait, can't wait, can't wait for the reveal of um, the next gen Microsoft. I'm telling you, man, Microsoft, I say this all the time, Microsoft has been firing on full cylinders this generation. All right, I have a couple more news items before we head out um, from this video. Animal Crossing and the Switch has been killing it. The NPD numbers have come in and the Switch has had a record setting number. I, This is what I told dudes on Twitter. When my brother called me and said his wife was looking to get Animal Crossing and a Switch Lite, I knew the sales were gonna, the sales are gonna be crazy because she does not play video games. And if she is looking to get a Switch just for Animal Crossing, I know Nintendo's done their marketing job and it was about to take off. And so Animal Crossing, um, when it, I think it's the third highest Nintendo software launch ever in Nintendo's history. That's major. Nintendo has had a lot of huge games. So that's saying a lot. And um, the Switch sales in March, the highest sales for a console ever in March in the history of video games. That's crazy. <laughs> and so they did a good job marketing and pitching this game. Also, check out my last video on Mario Maker 2, a new update. I have to say it's almost a little too late. A little too late. The update is lit though, but I don't know how much time I'm going to be spending playing uh, Mario Maker 2. Other games I want to play right now. And the last news item for this video. Shout out to the whole homie, Only Mario. Um, there's a tra there's gonna be a Travis Scott Fortnite concert this Thursday. I can't live stream it because he's gonna be playing his music live, and y'all know who you YouTube is with the copyright claim. But I think that's dope. And and not only that, you can get a Travis Scott skin in the Fortnite store. I'm done, bro. This is a part of their. I think they're um, um I forgot what the series is like. Their legendary or all star skin um line. That's right. They got rappers in the game. <laughs> it's a wrap. <laughs> All right, dudes, what do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro, click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things game, bro. We out. Boy. You still watching this video? That means you like me. You really like me. I got to hook you up. That's right. I'm giving away a $60 digital code every month for your platform of choice. Xbox, Nintendo, or PlayStation. Two ways to enter. One, make sure you're subscribed to this fire right here on YouTube. Two, 
follow me on Twitter at Obi Wan Plays, and that's it. You're in for the giveaway. But wait, there's more. Do you want to join an awesome gaming Discord with prizes and tournaments? Do you want to get on my friend list and game with your boy? Become a sponsor. Three ways to join. One, subscribe on Twitch. If you have Twitch Prime, you can do it for free. Two, click the join button right here on YouTube and become a member. And the third way to join, patreon.com backslash obi one plays. You'll thank me later. Also, check out the swag, bro. Links are in the description. I'll see you later. Deuces.